sugar plums welcome back to my channel today I'm bringing you a fun video for all my blanks out there yes we're gonna be working with black pink so guys I want you to watch until the end of the video because we'll be announcing our first giveaway on this channel and of course it's gonna be involving all fucking vests of the girls so if you want to get your hands on one of them watch until the end of the video to get the detail of the giveaway thank you so so very much guys for all of you who have been supporting me and showing me love guys thank you for coming back and if you're new welcome guys without any further ado let's just go ahead and jump into the tutorial okay guys today for the blackpink angel series we're gonna go ahead and do miss jenny and miss jenny is gonna be a sexy angel now as always what we did is the same thing you know paint the whole canvas black and then uh, add some um, black i mean some um, pink some uh, red some white uh, pink color in the middle brightening it up and then add a bunch of glitter on it and then we let it dry overnight and then we're gonna go and add our, our sexy angel jenny in the middle and then we'll be right back <music> Okay guys, at first I wanted to use glitter for her wings, but unfortunately that did not turn out the way I wanted to. So I decided, you know what, let me just go ahead and use tones instead. And then um, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be adding you know, two different types of stone for her wings. One, it's a, like a light pink and then one is a hot pink. And then I'll also be using some black stone, some um, white stone as well. And then uh, guys, the reason that I chose uh, Sexy Angel for Miss Janie is because guys obviously is Jenny Jenny Kim is a very sexy and then that girl can be doing any type of silly faces and she still is as cute and as sexy as well guys um, this um, particular photograph I chose for her is because it's nothing you know extra about it but looking at her guys she is serving face that girl is so pretty it's not even funny and um, we're gonna go ahead and let you watch this I'm gonna be doing the same thing for both wings and again I don't want both of the wings to be identical I want them to be similar so that's why you're gonna be me uh, see me switching you know uh, some of the stone you know black on top or pink on top so you'll be seeing that after that again guys we're gonna be sharpening the wings with some uh, black markers and then we're gonna be adding the copper and the red uh, glue glitter uh, in, on, at the edge of the wings making sure that when they dry out it will have like uh, some type of glow to it and then guys I'm gonna let you watch this part and then I'll be right back
okay guys now that is done I'm gonna go ahead and use some very tiny little stone for her dress she have like a blue dress on so I'm gonna use tiny very tiny little stone those are the one that you use for your uh, nail art so um, that's what I'm doing right now I'm using those tiny little stone to uh, make sure that her dress is all glittered up and you know so it will be like shiny because basically you barely see her dress so the little bit that I see I'm gonna be using those uh, tiny um, uh, stone for it and after that guys we will be moving on to my favorite part doing her hair because we all know miss jenny do not like to change her hair she is very like consistent when it comes to having her black or brownish kind of hair and i wanted to change that because i want her, her hair to be like fairy like you know very sexy and you know like almost like a chrome color and that's what i'm gonna be using for her hair it's like uh it's a chrome powder pigment that um uh, it's for again it's for the nails but it will be looking amazing in her hair so you guys gonna be seeing me doing that basically the only thing i'm doing with the pigment is take like a tiny little bit of glue in a brush and then i'm gonna go ahead and you know brush that in in her hair and then pat the pat, uh, pack the pigment on top of her head and then you know with another uh, clean brush i'm gonna use it to smooth out the pigment and trace out you know her hair uh, but make sure that when you're doing this part guys if you're doing it uh to not uh, have any glue or pigment on her face so i'm being very 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 careful when i'm doing this part right there you know adding the pigment and then you'll see me with a clean uh, flat tip brush and i'm gonna go ahead and trace the hair with the pigment and she'll be looking amazing with that hair color i think she should try that one seriously all right guys i'm gonna let you watch and then i'll be right back guys moving on uh, you see me draw uh, a bunch of like different type of flowers on her canvas and those flowers are very basic they almost look like you know kiddish kind of flower the reason that I draw it that way is because you know Miss Janie sometimes is almost like a kid she's very cute and kiddish like so uh, I wanted to uh, for that to, ref to be reflected on her canvas although she can be very sexy you know and very like you know that face she she put on like saying that yes girl i know i'm sexy but she also have that cute side to her so i wanted that to be reflected as well in her canvas so i'm gonna go ahead and add different stone different size of um stone and different colors in her canvas and then i'll go, go ahead and use the the glitter glue again around the the flowers that i drew and then we're gonna be adding more stone on top of the glitter glue so the the you know the flowers can pop more and be more shiny and also guys at the very edge of the canvas i'll be adding some um, pink stone in both the top and the bottom and then guys after that we'll be right back to finish uh, her canvas so guys enjoy and then i'll be right back
okay guys this is the next morning when um the canvas was completely dry uh, you know overnight i'm gonna go ahead with the epoxy now you see me using my glove finally i got my glove back so i'm using um epoxy on top of it make sure that you know everything is all covered and very nice you know make sure that you have epoxy on the fourth side of the canvas and that's why that's one of the reason i put uh, the canvas on top of something and i also make sure that i have like some kind of flat um, books you know uh, under the canvas so that way you know everything is flat and level so i'm gonna go ahead and do that at um uh, the epoxy on top of it um, uh, use my heat gun again to remove any bubbles and then again guys we're gonna go ahead and let it dry overnight and then in the morning again I'm gonna go over it with uh, some uh, more epoxy but again I wanted to uh, to fill the stones in the in the canvas so you know that those tiny stones that I use you know I'm not gonna be filling them because they're so tiny but the big stone for in you know in the wings uh, I will be filling them and I'll, that's one of the things that I wanted so uh, guys we'll be right back and um, to show you uh, you know the finished um, product and then also guys again i'm gonna go ahead and remind you that this canvas also will be going in the giveaway guys so in order for you to enter the giveaway you all you have to do is subscribe to my youtube channel like the video leave me a comment let me let me know which one of the girls is your bias because this is the only way i'll be knowing which canvas to show to uh to send to the winner and then Follow me on Instagram and share the video also. Guys, this is all you have to do. Again, you know, subscribe to my YouTube channel, leave a comment, like this video, let me know which girl is your bias, follow me on Instagram, and then share the video. That's all you have to do, guys, and you can have Miss Jenny Kim or Miss Lisa or Miss Jisoo or Miss, you know, Rosé, you know, sent to you if you're the lucky winner. Okay, guys, as you can see, the canvas is done and it's looking amazing and her hair is so beautiful. Guys, thank you so so very much for stopping by and thank you to all of you already subscribed to my channel for all the love and support that I, I have been receiving well, from you guys uh, thank you so very much and guys don't forget to check the description box um, to get the link for the other girls video guys okay until next time guys I love you and I'll see you later bye